I remember hitting him up. Uh, and that one was clear because I was like, man, this guy came in. He was like, wow, he was on fire that day, and he was ready. He was like, man, my mic on? He don't say hi, nothing. He just walk in, do his thing, you know, track that thing. You know, I, I think I've said this in other interviews too. The, 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 the mic sometimes he got it like on that on that song in particular. He, he, you can hear it. He's like distorting it a little bit. He, it, it's 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 true emotion. You know what I'm saying? It's nothing that you wanted to stop and go back and say, okay, well, hold on, let's get the mic right and recapture that. You know what I'm saying? Nah, nah. Bomb first dot com. You know what I mean? Nah. You better capture moment right there. It don't matter if it's a little bit off or a little bit this or that. It, that's mm-hmm. what it was about. You know what I mean? I can remember that. That He was very, very, you know, emotional with that mm-hmm. one. And, you know, I think of all the pop songs, you know, like I said, of course I remember I Ain't Mad At You, Ambitions. But right. in a month's month, yeah, that definitely stands out. Home first dot know. com. And, uh, I mean, you know, the whole All Eyes on Me album, it was really cool because I got to work with a lot of different producers and different people. Mm-hmm. And, you know, I remember, you know, distinctly like the Devante sessions and the Bobcat sessions. And, you know, I, I just, uh, some of those were very distinctful. 